Some orphans find a family. Millions don't. Bad things happen to children left alone in the world. Children are on the street because they have run away from home in many instances due to poverty, are orphans or live on the pavement with their families. Almost half are self-employed. They sell flowers or other goods, work as rag pickers at tea stalls, as porters and loaders, as hawkers or other kinds of casual work. Most work 10 to 12 long hours. Lurking somewhere in our heads is the notion of the sanctity of childhood. Yet, in almost every country in the world in which you care to look, multitudes of them are being pushed onto the streets. Their population may change continually as their numbers may be manipulated laid down by coy governments, inflated by special interest groups. But the children themselves are always there. Estimates differ widely, anywhere from 30 to 170 million. Particular circumstances such as warfare, deteriorating economies and natural disasters can increase their numbers. Thus, Prior to the 1991 Gulf War, there were no reported street children in Iraq. With the ongoing conflict, UNICEF is alarmed by the growing numbers of orphans on the streets today. Over 30 wars and conflicts rage around the world. Some fill our TV screens with appalling images of distress, emphasizing war's brutalizing effect on man. They reveal a shaming pattern. 60 million people have been killed in wars during the 20th century. Over 80% of war casualties are now civilians, mainly women and children. The severe psychological wounds that war inflicts on children can scar them for life, crippling the very generations that must one day rebuild their devastated countries. For the future peace of the world, we must do everything in our power to help these children.